The MakerPi P3 Pro is a large format IDEX 3D printer with interchangeable heads. This means that it can go from doing IDEX 3D prints with multi-material or even doing duplicate or mirror mode prints to, with the change of a head, doing color mixing prints or even laser engraving. It has a variety of heads that you can swap out, including high temperature and flexible filament extruders, the P3 Pro is a super capable machine and it's built extremely well. However, it's not for everybody. The P3 Pro really requires a lot of effort on the part of the user to use, not just on the hardware side, though it does require you every time that you change the heads to remove and then swap out and then put back in four screws every single time. It's not too much to do, but at the same time, it kind of enters into the calculus of, do I want to change the heads for this job or just leave it where it is for a little while longer? But as it stands right now, the tool chain for it is practically non-existent, relying instead on third-party tools and third-party plugins to create the G-code that you need to run it, and in some cases, requiring you to edit that G-code by hand to make it compliant with the processes of this machine. Now, none of this is a deal breaker if you're the sort of person who can really enjoy hacking a machine and trying to make it work. And I have been able to test all of its functionality and I can endorse it and say, yes, it works. But at the same time, well, one thing that I love about 3D printing is that over the years, it's gotten easier and easier to use. When I started in 3D printing, this sort of half-finished tool chain that the user pretty much has to not only figure out, but sometimes develop the tools and pass them on to others to make it easier to use, that was common. That happened all the time. But these days, with kids opening up an Ender 3 on Christmas and printing on Boxing Day, this sort of machine that requires so much effort of its user feels like a relic of 3D printing's past. It's one step forward in functionality and two steps back in ease of use. But still, I can't deny that it is a step forward and it is moving towards the future where 3D printing isn't just about 3D printing, but it's about a fully featured making machine. And the MakerPi P3 Pro is an exciting step in that direction in many ways.